Hey, it's Denny Somak, and welcome to uh, another visit on the classic uh, rock travel of life. We're in Macon, Georgia, at the Big House. Now, this is, uh, of course, the uh, famous Allman Brothers house where they live, and today it's a museum. We stopped by, this is the outside stage where they have shows from time to time. And uh, we're gonna go inside and look around, but you know, if you're going traveling, uh, ooh, look at that piano, amazing. Okay, let's see. I don't know if this is a, uh, oh boy, this is a real piano from one of the many tours. I'm sure Chuck Lavelle and Greg Allman have played this piano. I, I don't know how to play it other than. That's all I can, all right, anchors away. Um, but, uh, you know what, it's the Almond Brothers house and, uh, let's go inside and see what we can find. Okay. No exceptions, as you can see. We're uh, getting to the entrance of the big house. So let's go. What history is here? Can you imagine? Come on. Okay, let's go in. Great memorabilia here. Look at this. Unbelievable. All these guitars and singles. And look at that. Artwork, original albums, t shirts, amplifiers. Plus, look at that. Allen Brothers Band. Look at that. Great stuff. Good posters. We're going to go upstairs now and see Dwayne's bedroom. And Barry Oakley's bedroom. As you can see, there's lots of great stuff here. More uh, it's not just personal pictures and guitars and who knows what else. Let's see. These are the different bedrooms. Ah, okay. Over this way. Look at this. This is Dwayne's bedroom. Huh. A lot of stuff went on there, I'll bet. Anyway, amazing, amazing stuff. Yeah, it's got a little fireplace in here. No. No. A lot of history in here. They would sit here, this is their listening room. They'd listen to the records. They had some interviews going on in the background. There's the turntable. More guitars. <laughs> we know what happened here, I bet. Can you imagine? This way. Of course, there's uh, Jimmy Carter with his own brother's t shirt. More memorabilia in here, posters, all sorts of things. And of course, this is the centerpiece of the room. The classic uh, peach artwork. It's on many of their uh, early albums. Again. Lots and lots of uh, notes. Here's a note from Jimmy Carter. 
thanking the Almond Brothers, I guess, for playing. Oh, enjoyed meeting you and your brother. Okay. Look at that. Yeah. Shirts. I'm on a Hall of Fame induction. This is when they play Radio City, sold out. Oh, look, another one of Johannes's posters. Oh, look at that. Famous album artist, Johannes. He did the uh, art for my Led Zeppelin book, just put on a little plug there. Uh, look at these concert bills from Bill Graham from the various places. Some handwritten lyrics over here. Let's see. Please call home. Okay. I think that's in that Dickie song. Anyway, this looks like, yep, yeah, more Dickie over here. Some Dwayne. Just every kind of, look at that. Eight tracks. Now, when's the last time you saw that? Eight tracks. Okay. All right, let's continue in. Factory Concerts presents, and that was uh, the round. That was actually uh, Dave Mason, Little Feet. Yeah, but this one here, this was the uh, warm-up date. This was in Washington Memorial Stadium. This was the warm-up date to Watkins Glen. If I'm not mistaken. Yeah, and instead of uh, Doug Sob and Wet Willie. Uh, the band played at Watkins Glen, but this is the warm-up date right before where they rehearsed for Watkins Glen. A lot of people don't know that. I've got that poster. And more gold records. Okay, this is, by the way, this pool table. This belonged to Cher and Greg when they were married. It was in their house. So, they're using it as a nice display thing. And I like the way they have it displayed under glass. They have all the great memorabilia and stuff. Now we're going to go in next. I'm going to take you into the kitchen because that's where Dickie Betts wrote Regular Man. This is the kitchen and it comes through here too. I guess all the appliances have been removed. But this is where Dickie Betts wrote Regular Man. As you can see, they got a lot of pictures of Dickie up there. And uh, right here at this table, which is, uh, like I said, this was the kitchen. Uh, being used partially as uh, part of the gift shop, the porch out there. But right here is where Ramble Man was written. Right in here. So that's kind of cool. Okay, we're going to go back to the gift shop, buy some things, then we're going to take off. Oh, look at that. I have it here. They do have it. See that? Are you filming? This was signed in number by the artist, too. I didn't know if I noticed that. Amazing. Yeah, see? There I am. Dog front, no. I remember when we shot that. Some guy named Art by Wood. Some guy named Wood. Okay. Kind of cool. I don't know what that is. I don't know. I'm sorry. Hi. Hello. How are you? I'm fine, thanks. So, what's the best selling t shirt? Uh, that's a good question. Depends on uh, what you like. I mean, if you like long sleeve, well, my choice is this one because the general shirt, it's got his New Year's resolution on the back. But as far as the, what's probably the, best, the, the most popular, the best seller. Golly, most, it's probably the, the, this, is, this is one of the best sellers. Yeah. And this one is. Right. And then this one because this was a 1972 uh, tour shirt. Right. And then this was just a remake of another. That was a remake. We got an original to a shirt up in the Fillmore room, and this was a remake uh -huh. of an original shirt, too. Right. What's your name? My name is Wendy. And how long have you been here? Oh, gosh, I've been a volunteer here about five and a half years. Oh, okay. so you know. You see this? Yes, sir. I'm the producer of this. Oh, really? This. 
But I just want to let you know it's been released on vinyl. Okay. I've seen you don't have it. Right. So you might want to tell uh, Richard. Richard, I sure to will. To order this live at the coffee pot, available from the same place he gets it, MVD. It's available as a two CD, a two vinyl set. Oh, okay. Awesome. Got to do a little promotion, you yeah? know. Heck yeah. Okay. Well, thank you very much. Hey, thank you. Appreciate for the it. Info. Hey, nice appreciate y'all stopping in, and I'll tell Richard about it. Yeah. That. I'll tell him some about it. Available on vinyl. Okay. Okay. Great. Right. Say, what's your, what's your name again? Denny. Denny. Somac. Stomach without the T. So That's Mac. how you're. I'm, so listed as the, I'm listed as the executive producer on there. Okay. You'll see Denny Somac. Yeah. Great. Thanks, okay. Denny. Appreciate Bye -bye. y'all. Y'all have a great day. Now be okay. careful. Okay. Out we go. That's the big house. Ah, see this? Mushroom knocker. <laughs> That's great. Okay. As we're leaving, just a little bit of background on this house. It was built in 1900. And it was the uh, place where the band hung, 70 to 73. And now it's their museum and gift shop. That's off to you guys. Okay.